name is Nakia, and I'm with Divine Elements of Design in the Decorator's Voice. I'm a certified interior decorator, professional organizer, and planning and productivity strategist. And if those are topics that you're interested in, please subscribe to this channel and hit the bell for notifications. In addition to my YouTube videos and blog posts, I also have a free course titled Five Days to Organize Life at Home. The information will be in the description box below. And I also have a planner, the Divine Life and Home Planner. And that information will be in the description box below. So as you can see, my California closet has gotten out of control. Yes, I am so ashamed. I'm so embarrassed. But if I show you my wins, I have to show you some of my not so wins. So my closet has kind of... <laughs> taken on a mind of its own so things have kind of been thrown together so what we're going to do today is we're going to get this closet organized we're going to get it back right and we're going to take out things that don't belong like this tooth fairy pillow so uh just <laughs> stay tuned and we're going to go ahead and get started we're also going to do some little bit of uh, reorganizing of some of the existing things we have so first I'll show you exactly what it looks like and then we're gonna go ahead and start doing the work. Okay, so this is what you see when you open up the door into my closet. Like this wall right here is really supposed to be like your favorite things that you have on display. Like my first shelf or two, they're okay. Then it gets kind of crazy and yeah, things are kind of just thrown together. Like the Christian Louboutin section is <laughs> just kind of thrown there. Then over here, these are some of like my newer shoes that I haven't even had a chance to, you know, put up. There are some like Prada tennis shoes on the bottoms. I've only worn them one time. Um, yeah, it's kind of crazy. There are some jewelry from Christmas that's still in the box. There is a purse I need to take to get fixed. And then when you come on this side, this is my Christmas present from last year. Oh my God, it's so gorgeous. It's this little Chanel tote. There was a dress behind it that I was going to wear to Margarita Ball, but I didn't. Um, there's my Neverfull. There's a, my Christmas, my birthday present for this year. And then as you can see, like, what is this doing there? What is like Tums doing there? You know, come on, kid, get it together. <sighs> and then those, I would say like the first three rows up there, I do not wear those shoes. I I can't tell you when the last time I've worn them. It's been at least five years. It's taken up precious space. So, yeah. And then on the other side, my clothes side is not too bad. I mean, those, the luggage over there is good. Um, That one purse on the upper right, corner that's my favorite purse i have to stop wearing it because i may need to take it to get fixed um the clothes are still kind of crazy it's not color coded like it was before these are like some of the shoes like these shoes right here these sandals are like my absolute favorites i have you know shoes just kind of thrown in crazy those right here those um oh my god these are like the most comfortable tennis shoes ever i love these oh my gosh these boots came from amazon for me to try on so yeah so we have a lot to do so that's what we're going to work on on this video yeah so that's what we're going to do so let's go ahead and get started i'm going to set the camera up and we're going to take out things we're not going to mess with the clothes but we're going to take out shoes that i will no longer wear i'm going to do the whole um you know does it spark joy thing to see if I should keep it or not. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I'm actually on a step stool, so we're gonna figure out exactly what we're gonna do. First, I'm going to just uh, remove or move these things down for a minute so I can see what I'm working with. So we have two bags, two tote bags, the Chanel and the, um, I forgot what other one was. Oh, the Versace. So this, I actually wore this for a Christmas party and I just put it there. This is a jacket to a suit. This is a really cute dress. I love this dress. It has like these little splits on the side. Anyhow, and then the Margarita Ball dress. So I'm gonna just sit these to the side for now so we can concentrate on the um, shoes. 
So this is very painful for me. Very painful for me. So what I want to do is I want to remove like a shelf. I'm thinking maybe one, uh, one, two. So four shelves. Because I want to be able to have a section where I can put purses and shoes that are kind of matching. So like say for example, these right here, I don't even remember. These are, I'm, I'm getting rid of these. These are going to get donated. So it's going to go to the donation pal. These right here, um, I have not worn these. I think I've only worn them once. So they look nice. They're going to get donated. I know you're probably thinking, these are some good shoes. Why am I getting rid of them? But if I'm not wearing them, like what is really the purpose of me even having them? These brown shoes. Uh, uh. You know what? We're going to put this to the maybe step. It's going to be maybe. And I can't even see if there's anything back there. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Ah. Okay. These are dusty. These are definitely going to get donated. These definitely donated. So it's going to go donation. So look, we've already cleared one shelf. And then I'm going to remove that. So these, so I have, let's see, these are really pretty Gianni beanies. I actually like these a lot. Then I also have, these are what, Jessica Simpsons. These are cute, I love these. And then these as well. So I'm like, do I really need three pair of gold shoes that I don't wear? Okay, I'm going to put this in a maybe because... If I get rid of these shoes, I'm going to think, oh my God, I needed some gold shoes and I don't have any. Then I have these little kitten heel ones. These are cute, but they're not really gold. They're like gunmetal or something. These, oh my God, these are so hard. These are like, they're not comfortable at all. They're cute, a cute heel. That's definitely going to donation. Wow, I'm so happy. I've actually gotten rid of all this I could actually take this down so let's look at this section over here so I I'm not gonna wear these they're nice but I'm not gonna wear them these are nice I'm not gonna wear those either these gray ones all oh, these are the heel wasn't that bad it's a respectable heel it's like a work heel I'm gonna put that with the maybe section let's scoop my stool over a little bit but i'm actually at my bench to be able to see so let me move this box of shoes well it's like oh my god the closet is even more crazy now than it was before so let's see okay that's so much better all right okay Remember when these were in style? <laughs> yes, I do. Okay. These are so uncomfortable. I'm not even going to play with no lighter with these. No, I'm not wearing those. Um, these are Gianni Beanies. They are cute, but they are so uncomfortable. I don't, uh, I don't know. Okay. These were like I bought these shoes when I was getting ready to go on an event and my back went out and I couldn't wear heels. So I bought these little kitten heels. These shoes are like $20 or something. So they're going to get donated. These are some other shoes. They're like those other ones, but they're black. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. First of all, problems, right? Okay. I know what it is getting donated. These. I don't think I've even worn these shoes. I mean, look at the heel on these. It's like a weapon. So these are getting donated. These are getting donated. I think these are like a gift or something. I'm like, no. Yeah. These, these are coach. And I actually have um, a purse that match. I don't know what happened if this went off, but these are some more. I don't know if I'm going to keep these or not. Uh, I don't know. 
I'm donating these right here. I haven't worn these in forever, and I'm just kind of over a whole clock thing. Okay, so now we get to the second shelf. Oh, this is a little purse. I'm definitely keeping this purse. Maybe I'll put this with something. Um, so we've gotten, like, yeah, we've done really good. Oh, okay, so now let's see on this shelf. Well, really, I can't see, so I'm going to need a little spool. Okay, so these purple shoes, I don't know. I don't know. Ah, they're going to get donated. These hot pink ones, they're getting donated. These, like the church shoes, Nine West, donated. These, oh my God, horrible. Oh, uh, Ralph Lauren getting donated. I don't even know what other shoe like this is. This is a fun shoe, but yeah, this might get donated. This is a fun shoe, but it's getting donated too. Um, this, you know what? I thought about these. This is a good respectful heel. I think it's like a nine wish shoe, but I have an actually new pair of Christian Louis Vuittons, you know, the red bottoms, and they have, the heel is about, uh, should I get rid of these and just keep these? But these, if you know anything about these shoes, these are not for like walking or working or anything like that. This is look, they're to look cute when you're going someplace and that's it. So I'll consider keeping these because these are, uh, I'll consider keeping these because I do wear those. Um, these are some Ralph Lauren shoes, they're just, they're just comfortable. That's a big heel, it's a respectful heel. Um, these clogs, I'm sorry, I'm getting rid of the clogs. Okay, and I'm actually keeping these. I forgot where I got these from, but these are blue. They're really comfortable, and they match this purse right here. They match so cute. And it's like almost, you know, I love this look right here. So I'm definitely keeping keeping these. And I actually might put the shoe next to it because it's like a complete look. Okay. Um, these donated, can donate it. These are probably going to get donated too. Donated, 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 donated. And this is like a little hat I was going to wear. It's like one of those little events. Okay. And wow, that we did really, really good so far. I am going to put some shoes, but I'm not getting rid of all of my shoes. But like I said, I, what I want to do is I want to remove, you know, maybe I will leave those up there, remove these. And then maybe, I don't know. Well, let's look at this second shelf and see what we can do. So, okay, so this shelf right here is, I don't even know what it is. It's these slides, pink and sashi slides. I love those. Um, I'm just going to set those there. Here is like a little, I don't even know what, it's a drawstring bag, but it's so big. I got these from the Versace store when I bought like something. And I'm like, what am I going to do with this big old bag? Um, I don't think you guys can see me. Okay. These were getting donated. These yellow shoes. They are, well, you know, I think I'm going to keep them. I'm going to keep them because... They are a respectful heel, and the color is nice. So I think I will keep them. Um, these gray shoes, actually they're two. Well, I had a bunch of gray shoes, so uh, I might keep, get rid of both of these. Because what's the point of having this stuff and you can't see what you need? And then I'm getting rid of these. Because the way my back is set up, no, I can't wear all these crazy, you know, 20-inch shoes. I mean, that's something I could wear when I was in my 30s and stuff like that. I am going to keep these uh, pink, like, little Ralph Lauren shoes. I don't think I've, you know what, I've never worn these shoes. I may have worn them, like, one time. See how dusty they're on the bottom? They're, ugh. What should I do? Should I keep these on? Okay. Here I'm going to go. These right here are going to go. These are so comfortable. 
I bought these when I went to New York and Bradley was he was a, like a year old. He is 18 now, so it's time to freeze ago. But these are so comfortable. But I would wear where I would normally wear these shoes, I think I'm gonna wear those other shoes that I showed you earlier. Okay. So these are like perfume boxes. I don't know why I have these boxes. The boxes just look nice, but I'm gonna get rid of those boxes. Mm -hmm. This um Juicy Couture perfume. Oh, this smells so good. This was given to me to review from um from Juicy Couture. It wasn't Amazon, it was from actually Juicy Couture, and it it smelled so good. Okay, let's see. Oh yeah, and the the can the containers to those are like so cute. Okay, so this is glasses, boxes. Gucci, what's this? Anything? Okay, this is empty, but I think these are some shoes that are someplace. This is the box which should not be up there. Okay, so what I'm going to do, oh yeah. Oh my God, these are so old. These wooden clogs, they are so old. This is like probably like my first pair of like designer shoes and there are these coach wooden clogs. This was my first pair and this was my second pair. So uncomfortable. I mean, I've been wearing uncomfortable shoes for like, what, 50 years. This is crazy. Uh, I'm gonna let them go. Yeah, I think I'm gonna let them go. Okay. Because I'm not wearing those. I'm not wearing those. So what is the point of keeping stuff you're not gonna wear? Okay, so I think that's it. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go, I'm gonna pause. I'm gonna get a towel and wipe down all this dust because there's so much dust. And then we're gonna figure out which chef I wanna take down. And then we will put the things back. So... Stay tuned. We're actually getting getting moving good here. Okay, so this is what it looks like. Yeah, a literal hot mess. But at least those first two, four, six, pretty much eight. Shelves are clean, a little junk, whatnot on the other shelves. But look at this nightmare of shoes. Yeah. Okay, so I removed those two shelves. I wiped them down. And what I'm thinking I'm going to do is put my Neverfull here because that's a bag that I carry when I travel, not with the kids, but when I travel like just by myself or. Like a girl's trip or something like that and and plus it's you know one of my nicer bags so this is it i love this bag i actually got this bag from hawaii because they just i could not find them in the states at one time or in the continent of the united states so i am going to put this bag right here they call them never full a basic b bag but you know hey it is what it is. So I do have something in it that kind of stands it up, but so I have a little space. Now I do have some shoes. I have some uh they're not bands, but they actually match this print. I forgot what they are. Um when I'm doing my cleaning, I will put them there. So I'm thinking I may do the same with this shelf. I may take this shelf, but actually this side here, so my birthday bag, I was going to do a whole unboxing video for it, but I did not. So what I'm going to do is just kind of do an impromptu unboxing. I'm actually standing on a stool right now, so that's why I'm so far up. But this is my birthday, my birthday bag. It's in here. So you know what? I can actually just... Okay, so yeah. this is my birthday bag. Birthday for 2024. Okay, and this is kind of like unboxing. Okay, well, you know what? That's actually a nice box. So 
Let me open it up and show you my birthday present. Happy birthday to me. Isn't this adorable? Yes. And it matches my um, post lies. So when I saw this bag, I was like, oh my God, I have to get it. So what I'm going to do is put my birthday bag on this side. And then I'm going to put my birthday slides here as well. And then I may put a few more other things here because I want to fill this this area up. But yeah, I'm really liking the way everything looks right now. Um, yeah, so I'm liking the way it looks. You know what? I have some Versace perfume that's in my closet. It was in my office upstairs. And it's like, I think it's called Versace Bright Pink or something. That would look really cute here. But I need to kind of find a way to kind of show my shoes. I guess maybe like this. I don't know. But anywho, so we have the first two rows done. And I don't know if I want to do that for the other rows or, you know what, I really like the way this look. I actually kind of like would like to have that on this side, but I don't know. But anywho, I'm going to do a little working, a little configuring. I've spent a lot of time, so I might just get it done and we'll just see. So just be patient with me. Okay, so as you can see, you can actually see the ground of my closet. I'm so happy with the way everything looks. So this was that main wall that we were working on. So as you can see, I put my birthday purse in that one section with some other Versace items. My Neverfull is there. I actually have everything organized a lot better. I did keep some of the shoes that I said I was going to get rid of, but as you can see, there are actually shoes behind the top three that you see. So I still kept some of the shoes, but I got rid of a lot of shoes. And like I mentioned before, I was trying to kind of keep everything together, kind of have everything neat. But basically, I just wanted to be able to see what I had. So this is when you come inside. This is the first, you know, wall that you see. And I'm very pleased with the way everything looked. Um, I actually put those shoes out on display. So now I can see those with Prada shoes with the purse. And this section pretty much stayed the same or the same things are on it. But I just organized them a little bit better. So as you can see, I really cleaned this section out. And then also the red bottom section, I there's nothing laying down <laughs> as they were before. And, you know, these were the drawers that have locks. I normally keep my jewelry and my sunglasses. So on this section, that was that one purse that was hanging up with the shoes that I really love, those sandals. So they're low to the ground. They're right there. I can get to them fast. This is a section of, you know, some Gucci things that, you know, I wear often um, my favorite as of right now, my favorite tennis shoes. And then also, uh, high and behold, is my Christmas bag. That was a Christmas gift. So everything looks good. I'm very pleased with the way things look. My luggage is still over there along with some of my other bags. And I did not work on the clothes. I didn't color clothes the clothes like I did before. But that's definitely something I can do on another occasion so overall i'm very happy with the way my closet look this was a california closet that i had installed a few years ago and i'm just really you know happy that it's <laughs> i'm able to keep it organized now and it's not all haphazard and crazy looking as it was before so if you have any thoughts or comments i would love to hear your suggestions in the comment section below. I did get rid of a lot of shoes. As you can see, I kept some, but I got rid of a lot. So there really is no point of keeping shoes that I'm not gonna wear. It's just taking up space that I can use for things that I want. So anywho, thank you very much for helping me clean and organize my closet. I really appreciate everything. 
please give this video a thumbs up and like it. And also, if you are new to this channel, please subscribe. I would love to have you as one of my subscribers. So thank you very much and have a divine day. Goodbye.